Hi, it's Beth the Dip Queen, and I'm back to share another dip recipe for you. This is a recipe for chili cheese dip. It's so easy to make, anyone can do it. cannot remember a single family event that did not have this dip added, and I'm always embarrassed when people ask for the recipe because it's so easy to make. But to get started, you want to heat a crock pot and add two packages of cream cheese. Now, on top of that, you want to add two cans of no bean chili, and you're going to let these just heat together. So after you get this in the crock pot, just put a lid on it, let it get nice and hot together. Okay, the chili cheese dip has been cooking for about 10 minutes, and it looks to me like it's ready to go and ready to add the rest of the ingredients. The chili and the cream cheese are nice and melted together, and it's ready to finish up. Okay, you just need to add half a cup of shredded cheddar cheese, and three tablespoons of salsa. Just going to mix those up and let it heat through and the dip will be ready to go. Everything is stirred in and the dip is ready to enjoy. Now that the dip is ready to go, I'm just going to flip the heat setting to low. That's a great thing about crock pots like this one from Macy's is that they can flip, they have multiple settings, so you can change it so that you don't burn your dip throughout the duration of your event. Zoe, the official taste testing Yorkie, is back here to try out the chili cheese dip. Looks like another good one. Once again, the dip queen reigns supreme. From my Portland, Oregon kitchen to yours, Macy's keeps you cooking.